This particular haul I'm doing today, I want to thank the Line Jumper and Josh so much for sending me these five amazing backpacks. You all, here's the Line Jump information. You can follow them on Instagram, also on Facebook, and their website. Also, keep in mind that if you do decide to make a purchase with them, you can use code SWEETWILLER or SWEETWILLERS to get 10% off of your purchase. I know it's been a minute since I've done a haul video, you all, but I'm back and I'm happy and I'm excited. So let's go ahead and get into these amazing bags that the Line Jumper sent me. So this here will be one or two of the bags I actually have from the Castle Collection. I'm gonna show you all in this video. This here is the Tango backpack. I'm not even too sure. I haven't been keeping up to date on this Castle Collection, but from what I can remember, I don't remember the last one they released. If you all remember that, please put that down below in the comment section. Excuse your girl, listen, a whole lot of stuff going on, D23. Just it's just a whole lot going on but let me give you all a close-up look at this bag i really like the colors on this bag i don't think i have a bag this color green and if so i cannot remember it yeah not at this moment <laughs> oh yeah this is nice i like how they have the castle in the back right. we have these two and look at him he is so cute ain't he? this here is a really really nice bag here we have the side view so here we have the back of the bag. Now the good thing about this bag is that it does glow in the dark. Unfortunately for me, I cannot find my black. Like I think that joke of hiding from me. It's probably tired of me using it so much and went hiding somewhere. But I'ma find you. Best believe that. I must say this has to be one of the best back prints on these bags. I listen. I mean, look at this. This ain't nothing but love. Oh, that love right there. I wonder why nobody who got this bag showed the back of this bag yet online. Well, I haven't seen it yet. Not only am I happy I got the bag, but I got to show some of you all that never seen it before. Oh, snap. We got action. We got action. We got a slip. Look at old boy. He on one of them lanterns. Look at here. Look at here. Look at here. Look at here. One of the best inside decors on these castle bags and also the background. I already told y'all what I think about that. Listen, Lounge Fly. Y'all keep doing y'all thing over So that would be it for bag number one. Now let's move on to bag number two. Here we got Scooby Dooby Doo. Where are you? We got some work to do now. Scooby Dooby Doo, I see you. Do 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 da do da da. Y'all know how I go when y'all know the words. You hit that melody. It works every time. <laughs> I am a huge Scooby Dooby Doo fan. When I tell y'all when I was young, probably in my teenage years, I think when I got older, when they had BHS tapes, I would go buy a brand new one and record the Scooby Doo episodes and watch them over and over. Even though I already know who the bad guy's gonna be, I still love them. Let me give y'all a close up look at the bag. Love the Scooby Doo play. And then we got the villain. Got this guy here. Is this the creeper? Can't remember. Then we got Shaggy over here with them eyes. Shaggy sticking his tongue out of like we're gonna get low, 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 low. So we have a ghost right here, Scooby Doo, Fred, and Daphne. I was a little concerned when I didn't see Thelma on here. Love this little charm. Front pocket right here. Let's take y'all to the side. Yes, I was a little concerned on where Thelma was at, but she's on. Check out Thelma. If I had to cosplay as one of the Scooby Doo characters, it would definitely be Thelma. And we have the other side. Yes, I'm going to have to show y'all how it looks close up because it's too far away. I wish the ghost would come out of my Scooby Snacks. I'll be jumping up in somebody's arms like this too. Now we on to the back of the bag. All right, we got the creeper. Y'all, I hope I'm getting that, that building right. And we got all the other characters on the side of it. The only difference between me and them is I wouldn't be in this picture because I'd probably be running. Now it's time for me to show y'all the inside decor. I don't know what's going on lately, but I've been seeing a lot of slips in these bags, Lounge Fly. Y'all need to contact me ASAP. Now these, yeah, these are definitely the Scooby-Doo eyes. On to the next bag, shall I? So here's that second castle bag I was telling you all about that the line jumper sent me. We have Sleeping Beauty bag. Listen, I love these castle bags. They are absolutely amazing looking. Comment down below and tell me which one is your favorite castle bag. Y'all already know which one is my favorite. I don't even need to say it no more. Be like, girl, we already know, duh. See, we got the fairy. I like all the details on this bag. We got the little creatures, critters, birds, whatever you want to call it. We got Aurora. So nice. Need to, no need for me to show you all the other side because the other side pocket looks the same. There's nothing on it. But I'm going to take y'all to the back where something is on it. And they live happily ever after. Oh, I must say, that is one handsome Disney prince. Now it's time for me to show y'all the inside decor. Oh, snap. We got action. We got action. We got a slip. I like the fairies in here. 
I get a close up look at these fairies for y'all. This is nice. I love when they do inside decor anyway. Sometimes they don't always do it. They give us the plain colors. I mean, every, every blue moon, but you know, I really prefer not to have a solid color. That's just me. Moving on to the fourth bag, y'all. We almost done. Now, I'm just realizing by looking at these bags that I picked a lot of purple, blue looking bags this time around. I'm not mad at myself. Hey, but we have this Dr. Strange bag. Once again, this is another bag that does glow in the dark. I did go see Dr. Strange, and I must say it's an amazing movie. I know it's on Disney Plus right now, and I'm waiting on Thor to come on Disney Plus if it's not already on there so I can watch that because I didn't go to the movies and see it, but I did get my popcorn bucket. Best believe. That. I know a lot of folks were saying they should have called it the, the Scarlet Witch movie because it seemed to be mainly about her and they ain't lying about it. They ain't lying. We got our boy right there or oh girl. That's what I say when I don't remember or I can't think of the names at the moment. That's exactly what I do. So I apologize. I know how it be some folks' favorite characters and they be want to get me together all the way together. And I'm okay with that. Do your thing down there in the comment section. I say do your thing. Got Dr. Strange right here. I love how they changed the plate too. That's what I'm talking about right there. Just like the last bag I showed you all, the side pockets the same on the other side, so I don't need to show you that. But there is something on the back that I must show you. Somebody need to go and tell them Sweet Will's making a video. My first haul video in a long time, and this what they do? This what y'all gonna do me? This how we gonna play, all right? Don't make me come out here and do an inspection on that tree. I'm telling you right now. So what y'all want to do is calm it down. Give me like five or ten more minutes and y'all can go ahead and scratch legs, rub wings, do whatever y'all need to do together. But listen, keep it down out there, all right? Keep it down. Look, I'm sorry I got carried away. Okay. They won't keep playing. Oh, I ain't never had a bug try me before. And I'm telling you. But a uh, little space look on it. And we have this here. Oh. Yeah, this. I love the space look on the back. Oh, yeah. You know what? I do need to go to the Kennedy Space Center that's out here. Ah, yeah, I need to take me a trip over there. And once again, we got action. We got action. We got a slip. Inside the core is eh, a little so-so. I myself personally, personally don't like light color inside the cores because I don't want nothing I put in there to get dirty or the inside to get dirty. But that's just me. Thank you all for hanging in there with me. If you're still watching the video, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, definitely go ahead and subscribe. Now it's time for the grand finale. I'm going to show you all the final bag I have. You see it. You see it. Yes, Jurassic Park. I am using that baby as of right now. This will be my second week. And, and no, when I come to D23, I'm not bringing any of my long flight bags because I plan on getting at least three, I believe. Two for sure. I want to get the Tower of Terror if it's at Disneyland. Also, I want to get the Avatar backpack at the event and Baymax. So yeah, those are the three I plan on getting. I don't plan on getting a lot of stuff, you all. Believe it or not, when I go to D23 and you all, I do have a budget. Believe it or not, I've done that when I went to 2017. I think I spent maybe $450 when I went. Yeah, I know that's unbelievable, but I only went Friday. When I went to 2019, I spent maybe $1,100. Yeah, I'm, I'm sorry I'm getting off a subject real quick. When I go to events, I have to have a budget because I have already done a lot of impulse buying and I'm trying to get rid of stuff that I really don't need or I don't like as much anymore. So when I go to these events, I do have a certain budget and I only get what I love. Y'all comment down below and tell me if you all are like that when it comes to cons. Do you have a budget or you just get whatever you want to get? Put that down below in the comment section. Listen, there's no right answer, no wrong answer. We all are different. We all do things differently. It just That's just the way Sweet Wheels roll. But let's get on back to this bag. So we have this Jurassic Park bag. Yes, I decided to pull this joker out. I made mention about this before. I wear my bags, all right? And I wear them every two weeks. Every two weeks, I'm switching out the bag and I do take these to work. Give y'all a close-up look at this. The plate I love. I love this plate. And look at the details on this bag. This is one of them bags where you're not worrying about the placement. <laughs> yeah, ain't nobody worrying about no placement because you could barely see it. Unless you super, super de-duper into detail, then you probably be concerned. You see we have the zipper. And we have the charm on it. Really nice. So here's the inside decor of this bag. No, I'm not going to open it up to show you all. Y'all you, need to see what I got going on. But right here, you can see I got a pen and some coupons. I mean, you never know when you need to write some down. You, you never know when you need to save some money at the store. I'm just putting it out there. Wink, wink. I found the um the Jurassic Park gate with old boy. I can't think of his name right now. I found that at Target. And I played around so much until I finally found one. It was kind of somewhat beat up, but I didn't care because it's not online no more. And I don't think I'm going to find it in the store. So I went ahead and got that.
But yeah, this is a really awesome bag. Here's the details of the dinosaurs, just in case you didn't see it. Hopefully I'm showing it good enough. Hopefully you all can see it. And this on the side pocket. This will be on both side pockets. The details of these dinosaurs. Yeah, I like this. Mm-hmm. If you had to be any dinosaur, which one would you be? Hmm, I have to go with T-Rex. That's me. What about y'all? Once again, I want to thank the Lion Jumper for sending me these amazing bags. I love each and every one of them. Thank you all so much. Don't forget, you all, if you're interested in purchasing anything from the Lion Jumper, you can go to their website, follow them on Instagram, and also Facebook. And if you make a purchase, use discount code SWEETWILLERS or SWEETWILLER to receive 10% off of your purchase. All right, everyone, so that'll do it for my video today. I hope you enjoyed it. And like always, if you're watching this video and you had not subscribed to my channel, definitely go ahead and subscribe like share and comment on this video also hit that notification bell make sure you click on all so you can be notified whenever i drop a video or a community post and until next time everyone take care